it really helped me have my own first major project in, the, in a research lab, which was thrilling, exciting, and terrifying. But without that, I wouldn't know that I really do want to pursue my PhD. So, in my first research experience in high school, I was on a very guided track of what I needed to do. It was a good experience and I learned a lot of skills. After that, it was the absolute best thing that could have happened to me to have an experience in which I had complete control of my experiment. And I had to learn, I had to read papers and devise my own experiments. And without the, without the funds from the undergraduate research fellowship, I could have done that. It helped me realize that I really enjoy independent scientific research. I enjoy going through papers and I enjoy devising my own questions and really seeing them through. So it really helped me realize that graduate, graduate studies are for me, that that's important in my life. And so as a result, I'm, after, I, after I graduate, I'm gonna take a year off and hopefully work in a lab and simultaneously apply for MD, PhD programs. As a freshman, it's, it's, it can be challenging to find the right experience. And I think I got very lucky in joining a lab in which, one, it was small, and two, the, um, my PI was very caring and very um, personable. I think especially as a freshman, as a first year, when you're not as sure what you want to do or how to do it, having face time with a faculty member is huge. So if I were talking to a freshman and I've been asked this question before, I would say one, look, make sure you resonate with the faculty member. Because the research is, is important and whether or not you like the research that they do is important, but arguably equally important is that you get along with your faculty member and that they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna want to train you, they're gonna want to work with you. And sometimes certain faculty members, they're, they're very good, but they're traveling a lot or they have a huge lab and so they can't quite give you that face time that you need, especially as a young student. So in my experience, that was one of the best things that happened about choosing a small lab with a young, energetic PI. To be honest, I didn't, as a, as a freshman, as a freshman sophomore, I didn't 100% understand what Dr. Sullivan did in his lab. And I think even when he told me the project, I didn't quite understand them all. But I mean, that's how it's gonna be for any freshman or sophomore who haven't taken a lot of your coursework yet. So even if you read a lot of the literature that's, that that professor is doing, you might not even understand it. And that's why I emphasize, make sure that you're, you, you get along with that faculty member and that you resonate with that because, yeah, especially as a freshman sophomore, you don't know a lot of things. Definitely a great experience for anyone who wants to do graduate level research. And if, if you get it, it's, it's really exciting. Definitely apply for this grant. I mean, having fun to do any type of research changes the game entirely. I mean, it's one thing to ask questions, but to have the funds to do it, to actually answer those questions, changes your entire research process.